I won. How? Obviously, because I'm the greatest, duh. Or because you're a cheater. Hey, no need to get mad, Ariel. It's not my fault that you guys can't be as awesome as me. Well, I would just wait. One day, one of us gonna be you. Tuh, do you know who I am? I am the queen. It's not my fault that you guys can't be as awesome as me. Just shut up. Is that jealousy I hear? Seriously, stop. I can't hear about all that jealousy. You know what? I'm tired of your crap. All you do is brag and boast about everything. Well, guess what? It's nothing, okay? Maybe that's why you don't have a boyfriend and Scott doesn't want to talk to us anymore. You know what you should do? Gain some self-control. It's just a card game. It's no need to get mad over it. What about you guys just practice with each other? Maybe you guys can win a game towards me. You know what? I'm tired of your crap. Seriously? You should have just stopped. My girl, you did. It's okay. She'll get over it. We can play another game. Hello? not to date him in the first place. I just didn't know it was going to end up like this. He's a player, and I think we both know you deserve a lot better than that. And why does it hurt? And why can't I stop crying, baby? Why are you crying? You should feel free now. I thought he was the perfect lover. Well, in my opinion, he wasn't really that cute in the first place. I love him, though. You love him? Girl, it's only been three weeks. What do you know? You are in a relationship. Look. There's a thousand fish in the sea, and most of them are better looking than him anyways. And I'll kill you. Okay, it was just a joke. Your jokes are bad, and you're really not any help at all. What do you mean I'm not any help? You're supposed to be my close friend. I'm your best friend. You just need to stop overreacting. I'm not the one overreacting. Hey, I'll call you right back. Someone's calling me. Fine, I'll talk to you later. Hello? This is Terry speaking. Hey man, what if they don't call? Don't worry, they'll call you. <laughs> it's funny. It's so funny. Why this school out of a million other schools? Because this school... Ah, I didn't ask you all that. <clears throat> Say for instance, this is the one school. Compared to all these other schools, what if the school don't call? They will call. <laughs> you know, my honest opinion, fuck college. You don't need it. <laughs> so that's what you did? You just gave up? No, no, see, it's not funny, man. Like, what's funny is that me and you, we've all been boys. But me and you, we've known each other forever, since day one. And every day since we've had our big dreams, all we could ever talk about was going to college. And yet, look at this. You telling me to turn down my one opportunity to greatness because you don't want me to. Hello? What was that? Here's nothing. Okay, so our anniversary is coming up. I know. And there's this really nice restaurant downtown that I think we should go to. I'm sorry, hold on. Sure. You sure there's nothing in Genesis? I promise. What were you saying? Uh, yeah, this, the restaurant. It's got like this ice sculpture and I'm a big fountain. Everything basically is awesome. Yo, yo, are you listening? Yeah, you said something about a ice sculpture and a fountain at the restaurant. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, I was thinking that if you wanted to, we could go. 
Yo, could you get off the phone for like 10 seconds and listen to me? I am. Who are you texting anyway? Nobody, I told you that. Okay, all right, fine. Okay, Look. see, I'm putting it up. Thank you. Anyway, I wanted to take you out to this little restaurant because I think that you like it. I think I would. Could you, like, give me the phone? What? Give it to me. No! Just, I'm not, phone. no. No, what? Hello? Who is this? Huh? Did you take my phone again? Yeah, I was just on the phone with one of my friends. He said he was gonna call me right back. No, every time it sits in the mind, it ends up breaking. That's not true. Yes, it is. Now get my phone back. We gonna learn to stop trusting you, brother. We get a job and start paying for your own stuff. Well, look, you know, I'm trying to just that nobody won't hire me yet. Most likely because you're a class and unreliable person. Look, I love you and all, but I just can't be lending you my stuff anymore. Now get my phone back as I go on my day. It's been a long time, my 12 friends. Who is this and how do you know who we are? Listen to me and everything will be explained. My name is Afikius, now known as the 13th sign. I was once like you. I was once a zodiac sign. But centuries ago, my existence started to Greece, and as soon as I know it, the 13 signs became 12. After my disappearance and name, I went into a state of rest. I slept year after year, and now finally I have awoken. And what I wake up to is a fury of hate towards this world. They use you like you're some toy. They make false principles of who you are and how you're like and what you stand for. And why does that matter? Because this world needs to know to never look down at us and that our names isn't something to be forgotten. What's the point of you telling us this? You can't stop us from forgetting. Oh. But we can. We can make sure this world never forgets our names and that they will never treat us like this again. We will take over this world and eradicate all the ones who oppose us. We will become the rulers. And I'm sure we all know that we are more than capable of doing that. I do not expect you to comply right away. You have until 7 o'clock tonight to meet me. I will send your maps to your phone and that is where the plan will begin. What if we don't show? If so happens that you don't show, I will take that as defiance and you will be the first to suffer the consequences. Oh, by the way, Thanks to you little Gemini there. I know every single move you have made. There is nowhere to run and nowhere to hide. Now I expect you to make the right decision. I say it's no 13 song. I think it was just a prank call. And if there is, just tell you got the queen by your side. How can we be so laid back? Even if it's not real, we shouldn't take the threat so lightly. I think you guys are making a big deal out of that. I'm going to the 13th, and if you were smart, you would come with. You know what going to him means? It means I won't die here. It means you lost all hope and betrayed us. Look, I know you're scared, but we'll get through this together. Let's go. Come on, he's waiting for us. That was a nice performance you just put on. Almost lost hope for you. But you're lucky. I had to cover your butt with Gemini's. She was the devious one, but she wasn't so clever. Always texting. 
she couldn't make it any more obvious. But because of you, I'll know every step they make, and I plan on keeping it that way. Don't you think so, Scorpio? We will now become rulers of this world. If anybody tries to defy us, well, they just gotta suffer the consequences. So this song